everybody welcome to my channel this is reading truth to roll by clara i am clara and today we are reading truth today i have the palo santo going to cleanse the energy so that i can keep my energy up and that we can get clear guided messages for which they are intended ask the universe to god protect and assist me for capricorn Messages for Capricorn. Capricorn, I see success coming in for you here. Oh my God. Okay, Capricorn, I see success. I see money, abundance, longevity. Someone here wants a stable new foundation with you here, possibly marriage. You could be emotional about something here, or someone could be around you emotional here. But it's like someone doesn't want you to like, you know, reap the rewards here, so to speak. They don't want you to build your money, their mon your money. And it's made it's actually bothering someone's spirit here. But it's like you're still doing what you have to do here while these cars are flying. There's a secret here that either you found out or you're going to find out about someone here or something here. You're sitting in your, you're standing in your empress energy here. You're full of abundance, creativity, new things, new great things are coming towards you. You have the sun here. So it's like wish fulfillment, happiness. This is a yes card if you're looking for something to come in. You know, if you need an answer to something, that's my answer. My uh, answer is yes for that one. You could be sitting there feeling like you have to defend yourself keep yourself guarded from certain people in your life been defensive but in hopes and fears it's like people are worried that you're you know sitting on your throne here that you're you know manifesting your life here what you want they see you also as beautiful as creative as hard working here so some of you, oh, the whole, most of my deck just fell. Give me just a second, guys. For most of you, for some of you, not most of you, but some of you, there may be another woman somewhere lingering there. So, that, you know, because also the, the Queen of Wands also represents another woman, so... You may feel like there's another woman. I just saw this Ace of Pentacles. But it's like your money, everything is coming into fruition. Everything is coming into abundance. I see money. There's going to be a relationship or something is blocking it at this time. So let's dive and see what's going on. So I'm going to clarify that with, hold on, these are, yeah, let me do these cards. Someone could be holding a secret here. Someone could be dealing with another woman or, or something here. I also see things turning in your favor. I see there's a soulmate connection that's in the blocking. You could be older than someone. Um, you could be different than that person. And there could be a difference in age where it could be six years or so. It's like you have an intuition about the success that's coming in. You have a feeling. There also could be someone around you. You know, at the current moment, you may feel like things are up and down. You could feel like someone is juggling here or someone is trying to make you feel like you don't have, like there's no money here. But in fact, there's a whole lot of money here. Someone here could try to make you feel stuck in a situation here with the aid of a source, stuck in a commitment and a relationship. Someone could see that you're in your emotions right now, that you're highly intuitive. And someone is like thinking about what they want with you. Someone wants you to drop, you know, your guard. Like you could be guarded against someone or blocking them and they want you to drop that. Because the secret is someone loves you. There's love here and someone wants to build some kind of a relationship with you. You may also feel something for someone. It may be in secret or someone may feel something for you in secret. Like they see a commitment with you. You've also been very discerning here. So even if you're, you know, a Capricorn, you could be uh, becoming very discerning. Walk away. You're walking away from things that no longer serve you. And now you're walking into your happiness 
You're walking away from the past and coming into happiness now with the sun card here. It's like you need to make a decision in your environment, but you're not quite making a decision. You, but you're standing your ground. You're defending yourself here. Hold on. I just saw something. In hopes and fears, someone wants to grow a future with you. And someone sees hope with you. Someone sees you as very beautiful as a star and sees hope with you. And there's patience needed here. At the bottom of the deck, you have the world. So there's an ending of a cycle and a beginning of a new cycle. And someone younger than you could be an Aquarius or someone else that's simply spying and trying to learn more about you. Trying to figure out who you are. As I split the deck, I have the sun again wanting to come in. So this tells me basically happiness wants to come in for you. It's like you're going, you're heading towards your sun. There's something blocking it at the current time, but it's going to come in. You could be very discerning right now, especially like if you're coming into money, things like that. Only time will tell. This is past, present, a message for you. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light. I love you. Someone here could be deeply in love with you. Oh, I didn't even see this. Look inside yourself. Oh, sorry. Look inside yourself. Examine what is causing you to feel this way. You may be wanting to leave a situation for some type of reason here. And this says, the past is now behind you. Release it and embrace new possibilities. A new path is now available to you. Follow it with faith. So again, this is walking away from something that no longer serves you. It's time to walk towards your happiness. It's time to walk towards your happiness. Here's another one here. And it says, emotions are a natural and necessary part of life, but they can also distort your perception and cloud your vision. In order to see things clearly, you must let go of resentment. So you could be feeling resentment for some, to, towards someone here, but it's like saying to release that. Also, at the bottom of the deck, we have manifesting miracles your dream is soon to become reality trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance so basically staying in the flow forgiveness stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste you create your reality by what you think dream and imagine so it's basically saying release the past walk away from the past things that no longer serve you if you ever felt you know in this energy where you needed, you felt like I need to cut some people out, but you're not making that decision or making that move, but you're always having to defend yourself. It's time to release. It's time to turn this into the upright and make a decision and cut certain people out of your life. Because with certain people in your life, you're in this constant um, energy of having to defend yourself. It's like people putting you into things, into problems, into issues, and keeping you in drama. And it's like, no. No, it's, you have to you have to be more discerning. Let me see what else we have. Okay, Capricorn. Ooh, Capricorn. I cannot make this up as I went to shuffle the deck. The sun popped up again, yet a third time. So you have the sun here that popped up three times. So great things are coming towards you. And other than that is walking away. Again, you're walking away from things that no longer serve you. Poverty mind, lack mind, uh, people who are not loyal, who, you know, gossip or backstabbing type of people. Yeah, releasing this. It wanted to come out in the reverse. It's like coming out of third party situations. Working on your third, uh, your chakra, on your throat chakra here. Turn to your friends or be careful with them. You may even be walking away from certain friends here because you've been heartbroken by your friends as well. So you may be walking away. I see, oh, so much going on here. Okay, so some certain cards want to pull out. Adjacent possibilities is in the horizon for you. And of course, we have happiness and family here. 
Capricorn, this was your reading. Your third eye is opening. I just hold on. Something else wants to come out. And contracts. You may go into some contracts. And if things haven't been at balance, things will come into a balance. You may even get married because you may do it via court or something that of that manner. And then like have a big wedding or something like that. But you're basically walking away from things that no longer serve you. And balance is coming back into your life. Someone here wants to grow and manifest something with you. Love, life, house, you know, a commitment. Great things are coming in. Things that you're wishing for, it's all going to come in. It's like telling me drop your block, you know, drop any blocking or any negative, you know, because then you're blocking your money. So it's like any negative energy, please drop it. If there's anything in the past that's putting you in negative energy, release it, release them. I see hope here. Someone sees you as a star. Someone wants to heal a connection with you as well. Someone sees you as very hardworking and very intuitive. You may feel like you don't have enough money, but that's only an illusion. Everything is coming for you. Your money is going to grow and you're going to sit on your throne. Capricorn, this was your message. Until next time, namaste, love and light, and God bless.